Pricing power. This is a useful spreadsheet to price and graph some of our basic indicators. We have quantity, market price, total revenue, marginal revenue, total cost, average total cost, marginal cost, and economic, economic profits. Over here, we could start off with 50 for the market price, and we can increase it by $1 to see what the effect is. Over here, we have our quantity, and we can increase it by 20 or 10, whatever we want. Let's take a look at 100. It's usually easy to work with these round numbers. We have a market price of $45. We'll have a total revenue of 4500 That's the product of these two. Our marginal revenue is the difference in... We have D15, so our marginal revenue would be the difference in sales from D15 to D14. And then we would divide that by the difference in quantity which would be B15, B14. So our marginal revenue is 41. Here we have a cost that we need to supply. Our average total cost is the total cost divided by the quantity, in this case B100. Our marginal cost is the difference, the change from producing one additional item. So this one is we're going to use our total cost, F15. We're going to use F15, then we're going to minus F14, and then divide that by the quantity. And that's how we get, and that's how we'll get our marginal cost. Economic profit is, would be the total revenue, s total revenue minus cost, and that will be our economic profit. So in this case, we had $4,500 for total revenue, and our total cost was $1,600, leaving us a profit of $2,900. Here, everything is nicely graphed for us.